Hi and welcome to clickmyproject.com Let's be seeing now an efficient tree based algorithm for minimum sequence pattern with multiple minimum support. In this data, in this project via important, important techniques for determining the time relevant behavior in sequence database. In real life application, the frequency for various items in sequence database are not equal. If all item or sets with the same minimum support, the rare item problem may be keen. Meaning the we are unable to effective relevant interesting pattern regardless of whether minimum support is too high or too low. In this proposed system we are using for minimum item support for each item according to the natural frequency and then we can use multiple support general sequence pattern in this algorithm wise we can complete set of sequence pattern finding then pre-order linkage multiple support tree in this uh, tree via we can compress the sequence tree database so this process via in, in this project how can be efficient we can find out through this application now we are seeing data flow about in this project start the process and compress the data set through original data set then we are organize the sequence order and give the inputs value and based on arrange the sequence pattern order then we find out the minimum sequence pattern through the two algorithms after that that find out means we it will be in this project will be finished this is our project source code now we can run the overall package this is our smash window this is our main window for uh, our process we can make database now then we import the IBM datasets, supermarket datasets, load the datasets. This take few time because uh, more than two thousand records having here. then go to next page this page is sequence data set process this is our sequence data database this frame we are we can find out the 35 order id is one time remitted before that sequence order it's getting um, one or more times now we can arrange the only one time through the sequence order algorithm wise then we can get, we can find out the general sequence patterns It's take two time because it's find out the the two thousand record twice. Then go to next page find out the minimum item support value for each items then 
now we give the one input value for uh, this process In this project via the paper value compressed to the overall data sets. This is unsorted and sorted sequence pattern. This is our final pro form. This form via you can find out the overall multiple support sequence condition pattern growth. This is our result. Then we can find out the evolution part. Thank you.